Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon and we're going to do something a little bit different today. We're going to talk about toys. Uh, we're going to do kind of a toy review. We're going to look at the uh, Tubbs Transformers rubber ducks. Yeah, we're going to talk about rubber ducks, right? Um, so we do toy reviews on the channel occasionally. I haven't done as many as, as we used to. If you guys are looking for more of this kind of content, let me know. Uh, we'll do more of it. But uh, we had our friends over at Tubbs reach out and say, hey, you guys want some of our ducks? And I said, sure, we like free ducks. We'll take some ducks. So we're going to take a look at these ducks and uh, give our thoughts on them. We actually have some of these Tubbs toys in our collection uh, already. Cosplaying ducks, has you? <laughs> and uh, the fact that they're doing Transformers is uh, fantastic. I, I love these things. We have, here's a Sonic one we have. Check it out. So anyway, let's let's take a look at these. These are tubs, rubber ducks. They're large. They come in a, a bathtub. They're licensed characters. They've got, uh, let's see, Ghostbusters. They've got video game characters. Um, Transformers I was very interested in. So we're going to take a look. This is uh, Megatron, of course, number two, and uh, Optimus Prime. And if I had to guess, I don't know if they're doing more or not. The way things are going, it'll probably be Bumblebee and Starscream or Bumblebee and Grimlock because it seems like they've got like five or six characters that they just keep kind of doing the core the core characters now, G1 characters. But um, for those of you who don't know, these are actually pretty big. Let's see if we can open one with one hand here. There we go. Get Optimus out. Look at that. So this is Optimus Prime. He's got like a like a unifoot going on there. Now these are hard. These are uh, actually made by Numskull. And uh, these guys actually do a lot of like licensed video game stuff. But um, no, he's he's nice. He's solid. Um, I actually have a Borderlands uh, tubs on my, my desk. Um, they come with a little, little tray. Now, uh, let's see here. I don't know if you want to actually take these in the bathtub or not, but they're great collectibles. I, I actually like them quite a bit. Let's get it in on his eyes here. The paint job is really nice on Optimus. Maybe we'll take a look at Sonic too while we're at it. So there's Optimus. Let's take a look at Megatron. Now these guys, they don't squeak. They're actually uh, hard plastic. Get him open. There we go. Let's take a look at Megatron here. So he even got the, the red like inside his legs. Um, have we got a trigger on him? Are we allowed to have a trigger on a duck? Can you put a trigger on a duck? Again, the paint job's really nice. I like the eyes. Yeah, they don't squeak. They're hard plastic, but they're great, uh, great conversation pieces. Like I said, we have several of these around the studio. And uh, we'll take a look at Sonic while we're at it. Here's Sonic. I think they have Eggman and Tails. Here we go, yeah. They have a Dr. Eggman, too. Let's take a look at him. Oh. He's actually been sitting on our shelf for quite a while. Pretty cool. I think he's pretty cool. I think these are actually very cool. So thanks, uh, Tubbs and Numskull, for reaching out sending these guys over. Uh, again, if you guys want us to do more, you know, toy unboxings or reviews, um, you know, let us know. I mean, we're, we're trying to change up the content here a little bit over Clownfish TV. I get tired of complaining all the time. I really do. I really do. Because there actually is some good stuff out there. Uh, there really is. All right. Not as much as there used to be, of course, but, you know, there is some good stuff out there. So there you go, guys. Megatron and Optimus from Numskull, from Tubbs. Uh, we'll talk to you later.